Thank you, Nathan. I'm Doug Paget, D-O-U-G-P-A-G-I-T-T. I'm an evangelical pastor. There are many kinds of Christianity. There always has been. Those of us who've paid attention to the Bible are reminded that we have four Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, that tell the story differently. Difference in Christianity is a good thing. It has always been there. And there have always been times when people have had to say to one another, you're going the wrong way. You're not helping those you choose to love, you're hurting them. And so we say to one another, in the midst of our difference, when we're hurting one another, to change, to repent, to come back again, to start over. As Reverend Nathan said, Franklin Graham is a Christian, and I am a Christian. He is an evangelical. I am an evangelical. I have stood with his father on stages and welcomed people into the gospel of Jesus. When Franklin Graham allows people in his communities to say things about migrants on this border that are not true, that are slanderous and harmful, it is his responsibility as a leader to speak up. And when he doesn't, those others from the Christian community, from the diversity of Christianity around this country and around the world and throughout the ages, have a responsibility to speak up. Franklin Graham has chosen to be public in his views. He has chosen to be public in his invitation. And I want to remind him that he can walk across the street from the stadium where he will stand up and speak to Casa Alitas, a refugee shelter where he can sit down and listen to what the experience is of people who are seeking to enter this country. The struggle they live through because of the policies of our government that are supported by the people who choose to listen to Franklin Graham. And as all of us who are preachers need to be reminded, if you want to follow the gospel, you cannot simply speak, you have to listen. The kingdom of God is across the street, Franklin Graham. The kingdom of God is across the border, Franklin Graham. You are calling people to come forward tonight. We are calling you to cross the street and to cross the border. It is your chance to see the kingdom of God and to hear. We take you at your word that you're a man of faith, and we invite you to act on it. It is your responsibility as a leader who will use your name to invite people to the gospel, to take seriously the name of the one that you say you worship. And if you say that you love God and you hate your neighbor, if you say to a person, go and be well fed and don't care for them with your own life, you are simply making a mockery. You can speak with the tongues of angels or with a stadium full of hearers. But if you speak and act not with love, you are a clanging gong and a rattling cymbal. So we ask you, Franklin Graham, to use your reputation, to use your power, to use your family legacy, to listen and to find the kingdom of God on the other side of the places that you call home. Thank you.